The Hamlin Pied Pipers were a force to be reckoned with in 2018 when they put up their best record in four years, rolling through the regular season and making a trip to the Region 1-2A Finals before falling to District foe Albany. Now while the Pied Pipers had a number of standout stars on their 2018 team, two especially stood out, quarterback Braden Warner and running back Jackson Cepeda. Uh, well, I mean, last season we had a good playoff run. Really didn't end how everybody expected it to go, but it's just how it goes sometimes. And you learn a lot from two losses like that to the same team. And it really just gives you a chance to look back and you can't underestimate really any team out there. It's a lot of fun. It's, football field feels like home for most of us. It's just, we're at an, in our element. It's peaceful. We're not having to worry about this or that. And this girl, that girl, this guy, that guy. Just on the football field having fun with the boys and just doing what we love and we're in our element and having fun. The dynamic duo combined for over 4,000 yards last season with Braden throwing for 2,414 and 26 touchdowns and Jackson running for 1,411 yards with 30 touchdowns of his own. But what stands out over the crazy stats is that they both did that as sophomores. It was fun because we, we get to joke around in the backfield during games and we'll make fun of players, the other team, other coaches. And, We'll talk crap to our linemen, but the linemen, they, they do great every game. They pass block very well every game, run block very well every game. And if, I'm the, if I don't have it, Jackson doesn't have it, Jackson's a little banged up, I'm a little banged up. We, just, we can kind of lean on each other in the backfield, and the team can lean on us. And we just, we're able to switch around and do what we can and just do what the other can at the time. So with another year of experience under their belts, the sky is the limit for the junior juggernauts. I mean, nothing less than a district championship, obviously, after the loss. And then just taking it one week at a time and just focusing on the, what, who we play, what we have to work on, and then just obviously just having fun through it all. This year we're expecting bigger numbers, I'd say. Um, trying to just be more dominant than we were last year and dominate all aspects of the game, not just a little bit of throwing, a little bit of running. And dominate on defense as well. And our whole team, we're looking at a state championship this year and I think it's our best shot we've had in a while. And, we expect to be in Dallas and we expect to have a ring on our finger after the game. The backfield tandem of Warner and Cepeda, BCH Sports players to watch.